Phoenix saw her captain and her captain and fellow soldiers in the distance. Through a trick of the light, she could almost see them waving and calling to her. My brother's sword! No! Phoenix had never been allowed to hold the hallowed sword, a gift from Achilles for bravery and battle. Uh, it balanced perfectly in her palm, as if forged for it. Achilles' sword? Brother must have been good in battle. Is something wrong with your voice? I never got a sword. Just say. Phoenix looked up. She was not alone. She readied her sword for her first real fight. Phoenix felt her training come into focus. Should be able to survey the land from up there. <sighs> this is the largest statue of Hermes I've ever seen. I wonder who built it. Besieged by challenge, totally alone, this young hero was determined to save her fellow soldiers and brother. Boring! Can we skip this part? No, this is important for the sense of atmosphere. It's an honor to finally meet you in person. Just don't tell anyone I'm speaking to you. I got in enough trouble for memorizing stories instead of tilling the soil back at home. And then the other soldiers. Well, they really don't appreciate a good story.
Phoenix's destiny was becoming clear. So far, all you have shown me is a mortal soldier who has fought one real battle, and Typhon grows stronger by the hour. Don't toy with me, Prometheus. I swear to you that soldier shall be our salvation. A temple griffin? They aren't real! Let me go! Help! Hey! Alt, I'm coming! I need to find a way to reach that rift. to get down the pond Phoenix got into the Ambrosia too? Prometheus! You worried, Zeus, about losing this bet? Please, she can't use it anyway. Yet. Giron's blade with every step, its weight a reminder of the heavy responsibility. You gave him your blade. 